Hi guys, in this video, I want to show you how you can set up your iPhone 12 or iPhone 12 Pro or iPhone 12 Max for the first time and how you can transfer data over from your Android device. Now, before we begin, you need to go to your Android device and go to Play Store and you want to look up for an app called Move to iOS. This app will help us move the data over to your iPhone. So after you have installed it, you can uh, open the app and then now we're going to go back to the iPhone and what we want to uh, set it up so we're going to choose English now select your region so choose uh, your region that you want to install so I'm going to go down and look for the region so I'm going to choose United States and then next we're going to tap on set up manually now connect to Wi-Fi and then tap on the join button so now the phone is going to activate okay on the next screen tap on continued then you can set up face ID later or you can do it now it's up to you I'm going to do that later so I choose set up later in settings and here you can put in a passcode and I'll use a simple passcode Okay, when you get to the apps and data section, this is quite important that you don't skip uh, this part. You want to choose move data from Android. So choose move data from Android. And then it says move from Android. So tap on continued. And over here, it says enter this code on your Android device. So I'm going to tap on continued over here. And tap on agreed. Then tap on allowed. And then tap on continued. And I'm going to put the code on for my iPhone. So it's 109963. And then it say move to iOS. So the two phones will now attempt to talk to one another. So we're just going to wait. We say authenticating, preparing. It is now preparing to uh, migrate the data over. Okay, so now I say transfer data. Now over here you can see I've got Google account, messages, contacts, calendar and camera roll which is like photos. Now you can select or deselect and you may have more options than I do because on this phone here it is a testing device only so I do not have a lot of data, I do not have messages and other things. If you've got a lot of other things on your device, more options will appear down here and you can uh, choose to transfer them over by simply select or deselect them. If you want to uh, transfer everything, then make sure everything is selected on your device and tap on continued. And then it says move to iOS. And now the progress bar or the loading bar will now uh, start to progressing. Uh, it is important at this point that you do not uh, touch your device, do not cancel or anything because it is in the middle of transferring. Now another thing uh, to uh, take note is that uh, make sure that your iPhone have enough storage space to uh, complete the transfer over. So for example, if your iPhone only have 256 gigabyte and on your Android device you have like 300 gigabyte of data, then uh, all of the data will not be able to migrate over to your iOS. Uh, in fact, it may fail in the middle of the transferring process. So you want to first check to make sure that your iPhone have enough storage space uh, to support the data to transfer over. Now this process can be quick or long depending on how much data that you have. Now you can see here search transfer complete but over here the progress bar is still moving so you want to leave it alone until both devices transfer, transferring is completed. So now on both of the device it says transfer complete and on Android phone it says transfer complete so I'm going to tap on done on an Android phone and I'm going to go back to the home screen. Now I move that out of the way because the transfer is done, but we still need to complete the setup process on the iPhone. So I'm going to tap on continue setting up iPhone. And here we need to put in the Apple ID, or you can uh, put it in later. So you can skip, skip, um, sorry, you can skip it up, uh, sk skip it. And I'm going to choose set up later in settings and don't use. And then tap on agreed 
and then tap on continued and tap on continued um, we can uh, turn on iMessage and FaceTime now or later I'm going to choose not now and set up latest in settings set up latest in settings don't share continued 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 and welcome to iPhone so now we are at the home screen now some of the things that I have skipped previously you can always uh, go into settings and you can always assign to your iCloud you can go down to face ID to set up face ID so so you can always do that later on in settings uh, now the all the data is transferring over uh, the apps will be uh, loading and you can see the phone now start loading up uh, apps so any apps that you have installed on your iPhone, it will attempt to um, uh, replicate and install it from the App Store. Uh, certain things will not get transferred over, uh, like uh, books or ebooks will not get transferred over to your iPhone. You have to uh, transfer them over uh, manually. Now you will not be able to transfer music over using this method as well. You will need to uh, do it manually. So in the next videos i'm going to show you how you can transfer uh, music manually from your android phone over to your iphone 12 or the 12 pro and that's it thank you for watching this video please subscribe to my channel for more videos